from two things, how to create a notes passage and how to link back to other passages in our game. To create a notes passage, all you need to do is click on the right hand corner where it says passage. As you can see, this square is not attached to any other passage. We're gonna double click. We're gonna title this notes. In the space below, we can put any notes that we have about our game. We can talk about our characters, we can talk about the protagonist, antagonist, motivations and different things that we want to make sure that we remember for future use. Here is where I'll write ideas I have have for the characters. Our main character is Jack. We're going to close this. Now, let's try to link back to other passages. If we pick the option, Jack will go to the woods for help. I've already written, in the woods, Jack saw a path to his right and to his left. Which path did he take? I've already indicated there's a left and right passage, uh, both with the, the closed and open brackets to indicate that I've created a new passage. But let's, let's say that I want to have the player go home. We'll start by writing, let's go. And then we'll have two open brackets and hit a space. Then we'll notice that the different passages come up. We want to go back to the exposition. We'll click there. If we stopped right there, the players would read, let's go exposition, which makes little sense. So you want to go back and say, let's go home. We'll, we'll separate it with a vertical bar. All the players will see is let's go home with the link back to the exposition. Let's see what that might look like. We'll close here. This will allow the players to only see the word home and that will be the only link they see. We'll close this tab. We'll know that we've done our job correctly if we see two triangles on either side pointing back to each other. This means that these two things are linked back and forth. If we were to play our game, we'd open up, we'd see our, our story, we'd click Jack will go to the woods for help. We'll see he can go left, right, or home, and then he's brought back. I wanted to include all of these passages, all of these links to the passage, what we can easily do is select this phrase, hit edit, copy, go to the market, you could paste it there, close the tab, we see those two arrows pointing back and forth. If he's going to sell the milk, we also want him to give him a chance to go home. Close it there, and again, those arrows are pointing back and forth. Let's say that we want to give our players a chance to go even further back. So once they've turned left in the woods, uh, there he sees, let's say he sees a bear. We'll give him a link to the bear. And maybe he sees the bear and that will create a separate link. Let's say we also want him to return there. Making copy and paste. Let's go home. We'll close the tab, tab, and as we can see, if we had turned left, it went all the way back home. There's an arrow just pointing in one direction towards our exposition. 